It is Tiny House Hempcrete Pour Day 4. And it's coming along really well. Ah, snacks! We have been pouring and mixing and building and pouring and mixing and repeat and pouring and building and mixing. What's up? <laughs> you know, I used to pop off the plywood on the other sides of all this stuff. On the Non stop. It's good stuff. Move you over to another angle, shall we? It's up here getting this dope shot of the tiny home, and I found cherries. Look at that. There's a cherry tree by my tiny home. Fancy that. Mmm. Mmm. We're going to buy food again. I got my raspberries, cherries. The garden's going over here. Looks absolutely terrible right now. But soon, I will be living off the land. For now, it's just cherries and raspberries. <laughs> this is where you get the, the cherries. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you reach, like, the one <laughs> it is day six. Day two. We've gotta fill up the rest of these cavities. We're gonna try to knock it out today. We didn't film day five because it was just on the go, go, go. Thank you, Augie and Nicolette for coming and giving us a hand. And now it is time for the great reveal. Taking off all the forms so we can see this puppy and its beauty. Exterior is looking delicious. Interior looking even more delicious. You know that place over there on Lombard, the Is. They're pretty experimental. Yeah. They were using our cricket flower for bitters, like or for a rim, like a salt rim contest. Weird. Yeah. yeah they were like experimenting with um, sort of caterpillar. Mm. This is it, <clears throat> last day pouring hempcrete. I thought it was the last day yesterday, the day before, but we took off the forms to reveal a few spots that needed, needed some patches. So we're gonna pour one more batch of the crete. Fill up the holes that need to be patched and that is a hempcrete wrap. But first, snacks. 
Oh, look at this one. Hmm. Yummy. We were making these um, alcove shelves out of the hempcrete, and we took the casing off. We noticed some holes that formed, kind of just fell out. Created a little more casing so that we can just kind of hand pack it all back in there. Maybe just like little spots like this. Just a little touch up job, that's it. And then that is it for the mixing and the pouring of the hempcrete. Time to mix our final batch of hempcrete. Once we pull these forms off, but just trying to shove it kind of like back into these cracks, you know? Mm -hmm. There's a two by four over here that we can pack up against. Okay. I accidentally punched a hole out. Whoops. Scott is packing the remaining Crete and I'm doing a little house cleaning so we can start to uh, move in. <laughs> yeah, right. But really, I'm moving in. Tiny's first bath. Ooh. This is like the big reveal, kind of. 